guys welcome to this afternoon beautiful afternoon today I present to you my new pickup it's not the prettiest thing in the world but it's something I've been wanting for a long time Sorry for this amateur video here, but there's a few things that I wanted to present on my new pickup truck that I picked up. Um, it's been a while since I posted videos here. So yeah, just a little amateur video here, um, just showing off my pickup truck. Um, it is a 2003 Silverado. Um, there's a few cosmetic things that I wanted to show off here. Even though I got a good deal on it, it only has 170,000 miles, but it still needs some work, right? Um, there's some check engine light that uh, I scanned it in for the knock sensors, which I see a GM TSB bulletin that can handle or correct that, um, that problem. Um, other things here, the center console here. Now, this needs to be changed, obviously. Um, it is what's missing when I bought it and of course this is what happens when uh, <laughs> you get scratched this happens about a week ago so it's healing quite nicely um, pickup truck came with a nice stereo which is okay it's good it does its job um, it has a nice TV Entertainment center for the back, which is a plus. So as you can see in the back, it needs uh, just a replacement of a few things here. Um, you see the tailgate, as you can see it's broken. I could call it anti-theft for the moment, so I did order a um, key lock uh, feature by Bully. Uh, looks like they um, make a bezel with a lock on there so it uh, prevents anti-theft for my tailgate. Um, this neighborhood where I'm at right now, it's uh, very prone to that. So I'm glad I purchased that for right now. Um, center console. Oh yeah, and also the exhaust. Uh, the exhaust, that needs some work. Um, it sounds nice. I mean, it's it does its job, but it's kind of crooked and the exhaust tip's a little ugly. So I'm gonna go ahead and replace that exhaust tip, kind of uh, even it out. Uh, you know, I'm gonna take it maybe to Midas and see if they can go ahead and straighten that exhaust out and put a nice exhaust tip. I'm thinking of an SS, you know, the type of rectangular ones. Um, there's a lot of burr poop on it, but um, of course that's gonna be washed really quickly. Um, as you can see in the interior again, 170,000 miles, pretty low for a pickup truck. Um, the pedals, ugly as hell. I mean, I need to change those. I don't like those independent gas pedal Mexican belt. Yes, I know uh, my heritage is Mexican, but I'm not gonna go that way. I'm not gonna drop this truck. I'm not gonna be taquache and uh, make it into a good truck and burn out everywhere. I don't like that. I love the stock look of the Silverados. I'm keeping the rims. And another thing that it needs, tires. Uh, tires also are a must on this truck. As you can see, uh, these tires are gone and I'm gonna purchase some nice ones. Uh, not too expensive since I'm not gonna drive this truck a lot. I just need it to move, especially in this day and age where the gas prices are up the roof. Um, I will have to compromise and not drive it as much, but I still enjoy my pickup truck and just taking it around town. Um, yeah, I always wanted one of these trucks and um, yeah, unfortunately there's some things that, I mean, these trucks have gone through its age. I mean, getting one right now is really expensive. Um, so I found this one and a good deal. It just needs some uh, tender loving care. Headliner, a little bumpy there, but bubbly. Um, but I'll take care, it's just cosmetic. But other than that, it's in a great condition, smells good. Uh, doesn't smell like cigarettes or anything like that, which is good. Uh, but yeah, headlights, of course, headlights, tail lamps. We're going that route as well. 
Uh, so I'm just gonna go full on stock with this truck and uh, make it sound good, but also make it look as best as stock as possible. It's not gonna be the perfect example of it, uh, but that is my way to go. I know you guys will put rims on it and stuff, but not me. So first we will begin with the center console. 